Right now, Whitney Wilhart with the Children's Cancer Association, and there is this big connection between the Children's Cancer Association and the Blues Festival. I know it's a little hard to hear me. Tell us about the program uh, that you guys have, the partnership with the some of the musicians here. Sure. Yeah. So this is our first year partnering with the Waterfront Blues Festival. What we're going to be doing, or what we have been doing since yesterday, is filming in bed performances with the artists across the street at the Marriott. It's part of a campaign called Bedstock, where artists play from bed as a show of solidarity with kids who are stuck in their hospital beds. Tell me a little bit about the Children's Cancer Association and what you do year round. Sure, so the Children's Cancer Association is based here in Portland, but we provide joy-based programming across the country. Our programs leverage music, friendship, and nature, all with the um, goal to alleviate stress and anxiety and the perception of pain in kids and teens in the hospitals. And so with this Bedstock program, where do those videos go then? I'm assuming the kids can watch them, but it also sounds like a fundraising effort too. Yes, definitely. So the Bedstock videos go on in-hospital networks and also on mymusicrx.org, which is the digital extension of our bedside music program um, so that kids can actually see them directly from their hospital beds and access them 24 7 and then we also encourage the artists to post their videos on social media so we can reach their fans and increase our impact and they'll encourage them to donate too to help us fuel my music rx and eventually get it across the country what's your reach how many kids do you normally serve or have contact with throughout the course of a year for example my Music RX specifically has reached more than 221,000 kids and teens and their families since we started in 1995. And I think annually we reach about 35,000 kids, teens, and their families here in Portland. Well, Whitney, thank you so much for coming on to tell us about this because, like you said, this is a new partnership. So it's pretty exciting. Thank you. Thanks yeah. so much for having me. Yeah, thanks for being here.